Okay, according to calendar, it's spring. But in New York City, it feels like spring's still in the house. She ain't come out yet. Okay, she might have came out throughout the trash. She peeking out the window, giving us a little sun. But she ain't out, out. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, my name is Shauna, and this is a fashion channel. Fashion that you can wear to the office, fashion you can wear on the weekend. If you're new to the channel, get ready with me. Weekly editions, I get ready for the week. Seven outfits, seven days, something old, something new, something on sale, something blue. Um, getting ready for the week is super efficient for me. I'm a Monday to Friday, nine to five girl. I go into the office five days a week. Um, and once I open this closet, I'm late. Once I open this closet in the morning, I am late for work. So I like options. If I get ready just the night before, I may wake up in the morning, change my mind, um, or just may have a change of plans. So it's important for me to have like several things on the rack, ironed and ready to go in the morning. All right, so let's get into outfit number one. See how I just, the smile just come out when I start talking about clothes? Okay, outfit number one. So, uh, cargo jeans. Now, we know cargo jeans, jeans is on trend. Denim, cargo, these are like trend number one and two. Everybody was talking about the fashion over dupes. These are not the fashion over dupes. I did not get the Fashion Nova dupes. I haven't shopped at Fashion Nova, nothing against anyone that does. If you have Fashion Nova jeans, the cargo jeans, let me know in the comment section if you have them and like rate the quality from one to 10. 10 being like the best and one being the worst. Um, these jeans are by the Hudson. These are a Hudson uh, collab with Zoe Costello. Never had any Hudson jeans in my life, never tried them on, but I saw these on TikTok and I was like, you know what? Let me look up the reviews, looked up the reviews, Price, okay, car note, car note price. Um, but I got them and I love, love, love them. They feel amazing. Um, I got them in a size 25. Now, um, I got them in a 25 because all the reviews and all the videos that I checked said to size down. When you're shopping for high waist jeans, you need to get this measurement. This is the measurement you need to get, not this measurement. Because normally I'm a 26. And everybody that I saw that had their size said that it was too big for them. So a 25 is the best size for me, unless you have to worry about your hips. I don't gotta worry about that problem here. I ain't got no hip issue. Hip wear, okay? Hip wear. So 25 it was, and I absolutely love them. I've worn these already. I'm gonna wear them again. Um, these will be in heavy rotation. Heavy rotation. Um, I love the bottom frailed part. This is like really good. And I'm 5'7", just for height reference. So these fit me perfectly. I would have to wear them with like some sort of heel. I can't wear them with flats unless they'll be dragging on the floor. And I just don't think that's cute when I see girls with the pants like, I'm, it's, uh, anyway. If you go onto the website, a 20% off pops up like right away. So I think you can get 20% off at all times if this is your first time shopping there. I'm always trying to find a discount. Always trying to find a discount. I don't care how much I make. I'm always trying to find a discount. So let me just give you a, a disclaimer on these jeans. I got the black and I got the blue. The blue's going back, okay? The blue is going back and I'm gonna tell you why. And I'm gonna tell you why you may like the blue. Now I figured same jeans, you know, you see the shades when you click on the link, I figured they'll all be the same length. These were super long extra long like I'm 5'7 these are on the bottom swimming on me on the bottom so if you're a 5'9 five, 5'10 five, you would probably love these jeans and they will fit you really really good as far as like length but for me it's just too much and for me to take them in like go to the tailor I'll lose this on the bottom this design on the bottom and I don't want to lose it so these will end up going back nothing wrong with them I love them, they fit the same, but these are gonna end up going back because of the length. So I just wanted to put that out there. Um, the black, I don't know about the other color, it comes in three shades, um, but the black perfect length, these were really, really long. And when I went to the reviews for these specifically, that was a lot of the feedback, that these were like super long. So for my tall girls, you would love these. The rest of us, get somebody else to do it, okay? And I'm wearing everything that I'm showing you with an, uh, like a, a Zara bodysuit top because I really need to just invest in some regular basic tops, 
like bodysuit tops and I'm just doing this to show you how like versatile these tops can be with everything that you have on. Okay? All right. Now, number two, if you've been watching my videos, you know that I ordered this Bottega skirt on final sale. Now, stop buying things on final sale. I'm talking to me. Because if you get it and you don't like it, you stuck with it. Now, I got this in a size 40. Because those are like my Margella jeans. Like those are, you know, the size that I wear. And I figured a 40 would be my size. Too big. It's too big. Um, I, I got it at a really good price. I think I paid like two, 200 for it. Um, it flares out on the sides, which is cute. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. I don't know if I'm going to just maybe take it to see if I could like maybe take it to the real world and see if I could, you know, get it sold or get it taken in. I'm not sure. I probably can just get another button added somewhere and make it a little bit tighter. I mean, it fits, but it's just loose. I'm going to keep it on the rack because I may wake up and just decide to throw it on. Um, and I wasn't able to find this anywhere, but if I, I'll leave the link to the item that I purchased. So that way, if you want to look like on Poshmark or, you know, just do a Google search, you may be able to find it. But I love like the midi length skirt. I love that it flew, that it flares out on the side. I thought it was like really cute, but I saw this on someone and I did not notice size down and I got it on a final sale. So this would look really cute with a nice like form fitting top because it's loose on the bottom and maybe like a, my moto jacket. I've learned that Investing in a moto jacket was like really good for me because I wore a moto jacket so much. Um, so that's it with the Bottega Veneta skirt. Um, next are my Frankie Shop. I feel like I probably wear these every week or every other week. I only didn't wear them last week because I went to Florida. Um, other than that, I probably would have worn these. I love these Frankie Shop trousers. They are called the Tansy pleated trousers. These are pinstriped. I love these, love these, love these. They also come in black and they also come in khaki. Um, I probably will maybe get another pair because these are like, when I tell you I could wear these to the, the, the legs fall off, I could wear these to the legs fall off. So this will look really good. Now this is like a, I think this is like a light kind of wool material. So in wearing this, I would put on a tank top and maybe like a pop of color blazer. So this blazer I got from Zara's last year, it came with a, uh, some, it didn't come with it, but it was a part of a matching suit with pants. So I would just throw on like a pop of color blazer. And that's like what we're doing right now because we're trying to like push spring in, convince her to go outside. So I would add your like winter pants or your like, you know, pants that you're probably going to get a few more wears out of before you kind of put them away with your spring blazers. And this could be a yellow blazer, a pink blazer, a green, bla all the gender reveal colors. Okay, all the all the clothes that you would wear to the gender reveal party. That's what you could throw these on with. And again with a tank top. Again with a tank top. Next up are these Loewe pants. Now, I got these pants from the outlet. Okay? Now, I if you have a designer like any sort of premium outlets in your area, definitely go swing through and check the men's section. These are men's pants. These are men's pants that I got from the Loewe outlet. These are men cargo like dress pants. So I could take these in probably like maybe like a half an inch, but I'm going to just rock out and kind of leave them the way they are because I think that I can throw these on not to work, but like on a night out or something, I can put these pants on with like a corset or something like that and really have like the loose pants on the bottom and really just like va va boom it on the top. So I would keep these the same length. I ended up getting these, let me see what size these are, a size 46, whatever that means in Loewe men's. But love it, love the color, and it's going to rain two days this week, so I probably would throw these on with my Veronica Beard blazer. You guys know how I feel about Veronica Beard. Highly recommend their blazers. What I love about their blazers is they give you like that nice kind of shape, and that's like right from the rack. You know what I mean? A lot of times you, you buy blazers and it's like, oh, I love it, but I just wish it could be a little bit like 
smaller on the back or a little bit longer or flare out a little bit more their blazers fit me perfectly i'm normally a size four in top i'm a size six in their blazers and i love their blazers and they last don't hesitate to like look at Saks office nordstrom rack poshmark ebay because the quality of the blazer will be there and every blazer the quality was always 10 out of 10 it didn't matter where it was sold from and when it comes to blazers really it's more about what you need it's not about like trendy you know what i mean a black blazer won't be a black blazer won't be a black blazer. Next, this awake mode skirt now i there's some brands that i'm like really loving awake mode is one of them i ended up um lucking up and getting awake mode when they did a collaboration with and other stories so i was able to get uh and that awake mode blazer for way less than what it was in like Bergdorf or anywhere else. Once I put that blazer on my skin, I loved it, loved it, loved it. And that's like the back out blazer. That blazer, I feel like awake mode set the trend when it came to like the back out blazer because now everybody's doing the back out blazers. Everybody, every blazer you turn around, the back is out. But this was um, over maybe like seven, eight months ago. This is when these blazers kind of came out from awake mode. So they had a sale on their website a while back, a really good like archive sale. And I ended up getting this skirt, which I love, love, love. And this is a really good like transition to spring. You can wear this in the winter. I wore it in the winter, but this is a really good kind of like transition to spring um, skirt because of the color. And because it has like the flares here where you can like, you know, get your legs out and get a little breeze still. So I would, add this on the rack and i'm also just wearing it with a bodysuit but it would have been really nice if i had like maybe like a cream bodysuit or if the bodysuit was like short sleeve or something so i'm probably gonna like do a little bit of shopping for bodysuits and just get like some basics in that's what i feel like i really really need to do last year zara came out with this black like satin dress this is the cream version of it absolutely love it get this get this get it because that black one i wore whew, allergies that black one i wore to the wheels fell off and i'm gonna do the same thing to this when i tell you this the satin that zara i don't know where they pulling it from but it's just so 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 good they have uh this color cream with the nice like v-neck which is the one that i like the most and then they have a crew neck one that's in like a blue color which i'm not sure how i feel about the crew neck because i feel like crew neck always makes my you know boobs look a little bit big so i'm not really sure but i may just get it and i don't know if that blue one comes all the way to the ground like this is a maxi length satin dress 10 out of 10 10 out of 10 it's 59.90 i got it in size small that's my regular size. I wouldn't do an extra small because you really want the wiggle room with this. And I just trying this on with like this little denim shirt that I got from Zara's. You can put this on with a nice denim jacket. You can put it on with a blazer. You can put it on with a t-shirt underneath. So many things that you can do with, with these satin dresses. This, definitely an essential spring item. Definitely an I'm essential. I'm going to just bring these two pair of jeans out on the rack just in case. Um, I do have an event to go to on Tuesday night that i may wear either the cargo denim jeans for or i'll just have these as a backup these are zara when zara had last year the 90s full length jeans i went crazy i actually got two pair of jeans that were the same and didn't even realize it like that they went on sale i think they were like 20 dollars, and i just was like let me just get them because i love the way they fit so i was like i don't want to miss out on these so i ended up getting two pair and that's good because i can like really rip up one pair if i want to rip it up a little bit more um but these are my like ripped Zara 90s full length jeans. So I'm going to leave these out on the rack. I have these with the, the distressed and then I have another one that's not distressed. So it depends on, you know, the weather and how I'm feeling. If I want to wear like the distressed ones versus the not distressed ones. Um, they're the same size, size four. These are nice because they have like a little slit on the bottom. Really cute. And. I feel like Zara is just, let me tell you, Zara will pull out one pair of jeans and they'll be like, okay, these will be $49.90, $49.90. They'll take these jeans and say, okay, $49.90 plain. They'll take the jean, put a little rip here, $69.90. 
it be the, it, like when I put them on, it fits the exact same way. The colors, everything are pretty much the same. So I'm just feeling like that's exactly what they're doing. And we just out here buying them, not realizing we buying the same pair of jeans. One got one little cut on the right leg and one got one cut on the left leg. Honey, honey. So let me see what I got here. I have to go out and get some bodysuits. I have to do that. Um, okay, so we got the Hudson Cargos. We got the Bottega skirt. We got the Frankie Shop trousers. We got the Loewe pants with the Veronica Beer blazer. We got this with the uh, Zara blazer. This we have with a tank top and maybe a crop jacket. Uh, we have the Awake Mode skirt with a bodysuit. And then we have this that I can wear with a denim jacket. And then we have for backup, we have the denim jeans from Zara. And we also have the denim jeans from Hudson. Boom. Boom. So that's it. I would pull my bodysuits out, put them on the rack, and that is it. Like the things that I know, I, sometimes I leave like blazers and things like that on here. I have this top from Frame. Honey, shout out to everybody who got this when I posted this last year. Okay? Because now, send me the link, send me the link, honey. Honey, honey. I got this in this shade and I got it also in a white billowy sleeves will always be in always be in so i do have somewhat of an alternative not it's not blue and white but let me just show you this okay this is white this is from uh shop akira a k i r a okay i saw this on the yusuf's and this is a really good option if you want like billowy sleeves um that ain't going to billow your wallet. Do you know what I mean? So this is, let me put this up. I'm not going to wear this this week. Let me not confuse myself. So I have my moto jacket. This is a moto jacket by Michael Kors. Um, I did a Saks Outfit collaboration and I got this jacket from the collaboration. Um, and that is it. These are just some extra pieces that are here that I didn't get a chance to wear. But this is typically it. I'll get my body suits out, throw them on over the pants. And this like makes it super easy for me in the morning to get up, get dressed. I hope I ain't got, I hope my kitchen ain't showing. Honey, I'm natural. Okay, this is silly back here. Um, so that is it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Have a wonderful week. Happy April. It's the start of the second quarter of the year. I feel like, I feel like this is like the new year technically for a lot of people. They kind of feel like this is the start of 2023 for them. There will them. be another video on Friday. So uh, subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed and have a wonderful, wonderful week.